This is Gantz Mill at Bruton in Somerset, and uh, we've recently put in a hydropower unit. It's quite an old mill, um, and it was a doomsday mill site, so there was a mill here 800 years ago. Although the building that is behind uh, me now, that was built about 200 years ago as a silk mill. So it's a very, it was a very large building employing about 200 girls, but we're now looking for a modern use for it. Well, I think microgeneration definitely is the future at the moment, or historically, we've got power from large centralised power stations, and as much as 11% of the electricity can be lost through the power lines. Uh, with uh, local generation, it's close to the consumer, so there's very little uh, wastage. It was quite a lot of effort for us because it was um, a breakthrough project. Nobody had really done quite uh, this in the same way before. We had to get the grants and we had to get the abstraction licenses and the Environment Agency hadn't really had much experience of dealing with projects, uh, small projects like this. But now we've shown the way it can be done. It's going to be a lot simpler in the future and the technology is getting simpler. Uh, new turbines are being introduced that are cheaper and more efficient. Um, and the Environment Agency understand what needs to be done. So I'm, I, I don't think in the future it's going to be anywhere as near as difficult as it has been for us. Now the water comes down this red pipe, which is under pressure, into the blue turbine, and that mechanically turns the energy of the water into power, and then the belts turn the generator, which is mounted above, and that produces the electricity. This generator produces at the maximum about 12 kilowatts at any one time, and it runs continuously throughout the year, not producing so much electricity in the summer. Over the last 12 months, we've generated 32,000 kilowatt hours, and they reckon the average household uses about 4,000 kilowatt hours in a year. So this is equivalent to about eight houses worth of electricity over the course of the year that it produces. This is the control panel that uh, controls the turbine and uh, automatically it connects it to the national grid. So just wait a moment, off it'll go. There we are. Uh, so the benefits of having this hydropower installation is that uh, we are actually producing money, we are selling electricity from it. We are actually reducing carbon dioxide emissions because the electricity we generate has not been generated from oil fire or coal fire uh, power stations or gas fire. It's been generated from a renewable resource. Uh, we've got a good reason for keeping the mill going, keeping all the leads in order and it's also an additional interest because we have visitors looking around the mill which we show around the mill and it's an extra interest for them to see something that's happening
that is helping the environment.